In this video, we'll see how to change the desktop background or you can say this one as wallpaper, the screen wallpaper. Right now, this wallpaper you can keep on changing as per your requirement. If you have some your image, your, your photograph, you can also insert into this wallpaper itself. How do we do that? Very first thing is you need to have some image or file uh, which you want to put as a background. That is you have to download it or if, if you already have that's well and good. So what you can do is you can just right click on the screen here blank space and then after that if you see there's an option as personalize. So if I click on this personalize option I'll get this settings part as uh, desktop background colors lock screen and so on. These are different options. So I'll click on this background because I want to change the background of the screen here. Now if you see background it says do you want to add a picture or you want to add a solid color or do you want to add a, a slideshow? So I'll say I want to add a picture. These are the pictures which are available here right now. So you can select from the picture here. Let's say if I click on this picture, okay, and I'll click on this close. So if you see the background has changed here, right? Same way, I'll just right click again and click on this personalize. And I'll scroll down. It says choose your picture from here if you don't like picture from here, you can just browse at the location where you have the picture. So I'll just click on this browse. Okay. And I'll go to my folder. I have in quick access. I have this Windows 10 training. I have downloaded some image file. I have stored at this place Windows 10 training. Okay. And let's say I have this picture here and I'll say yes, choose picture. That's it. Once the picture, if you see there's a at the background you can see a bit here and now what I'll do is I'll close the background here. So if you see now I've got the picture here at the background that's a desktop wallpaper again. So if you want you can keep on changing the desktop background it's very simple and easy. The only method is you need to right click and you have to say as yes, personalize and then from here you have to just browse and bring it. Suppose if you do not like the picture if you do not want the picture you want a plain background. So what you can do is you can select from here instead of picture you select a solid background and these are the different backgrounds you can select. So if I select this background you see at the background you will get this red color here. If I select here let's say yellow color background you will get a yellow color background. Now I'll click on this close button and if you see I have no picture no image nothing I have just a plain background which is visible here. So professionally it looks very good here. I'll just right click again click on personalize and now if I scroll down if I again go to this slideshow what the slideshow says is if you have some 10 or 20 or 30 pictures it will keep on showing you the slideshow of that pictures like every one minute it will going to the another picture here right I'll scroll down so if I say slideshow windows 10 training that's a folder name which I've borrowed from there and it says change picture every one minute so minimum time you have that is one minute then you have 10 minutes 30 minutes and so on so one minute every one minute it will shuffle it will change it do you want to shuffle off allow slideshow when battery power uh, when uh, when on battery power so you can see as off or on depends right so and also you can choose a fit size how do you want to fit that image or the picture into your desktop you want to fill it you want to fit it you want to stretch or tile or center whatever you want you can select from here right now I don't want anything but I want the picture part here itself so I'll take the same picture which I want in the background part itself so I'll just click on this close button right so that's a picture background which is added here right so I hope you have understood how to change the desktop background or you also call it as a wallpaper of your desktop itself that's all for this video